My name is Tabitha and I come from England. Uh, I'm a PhD student in the Cognitive Ethology lab at the German Primate Center. I chose to come to Göttingen for the main part because of the Cognitive Ethology laboratory. Um, I met my supervisor at a conference before coming here and I knew of her work. Um, I've worked for previously for a few years with primates um, and wanted to continue doing my PhD in the same field. And yeah, my supervisor and colleagues within this laboratory are the specialists within this field and I wanted to work with them. So part of my PhD I do here in Germany, in Göttingen, at the German Primate Center. Um, but then because I study primates in the wild, I also spend field seasons working in Africa. Um, I spend some of the time working at the research site of the Cognitive Ethology Lab, which is based in Senegal, in West Africa. Um, and then my last field season, I spent some time in South Africa, um, working with wild populations of monkeys. Yeah, the group that I work in is quite a mixture, so um, quite a large number of PhD students uh, from both Germany. Some people have done their diploma students here, have been a diploma students here and then gone up to continue to do their PhD. And then there are some others coming from uh, other countries. Um, and then also some postdocs from America, so we are a nice mixture within the group. Um, a lot of people here have quite a wide experience of research, um, and I think from being here working with other Germans, I learned to have a broader perspective of the subject that I'm studying. Uh, I've always liked traveling, so I was quite excited actually to come to another country and to study somewhere different. Um, I'd never spent any time in Germany at all before coming here, um, but I think my main worry was the language. I didn't speak any German before coming. Um, so, yeah, this was, <laughs> this was a slight worry of how I would get by. Um, but I have a DAAD scholarship and this was very nice because they offer a two-month intensive German course when you first come. So, a sort of, um, <laughs> yeah, an emergency crash course in German. <laughs> and this was good. <laughs> my first day in Göttingen, I remember I arrived with a lot of stuff on the train. <laughs> I was met by somebody from the international office, I think, which was a nice way to arrive so that you are met with, with a friendly face when you, when you get there. Because it's a university town, I think there's quite a lot to do. Um, so from activities, sports activities at the, at the sports centre. Um, and then in the evenings, there's quite a lot of bars. And yeah, in the summer especially, it's nice when you can sit outside or down by the Kise, the local lake. It's nice for barbecues. If I think about the time that I've spent in Göttingen and why I would recommend for somebody else to come here, um, it would probably be for the academic experience for a start. I think Göttingen University has a very high standard of research, um, not only for topic specific modules, but colleagues of mine have enrolled in mentoring schemes and uh, found this very useful for future prospects in working in academia. Um, and outside it has a very international feel about it so it's quite nice you can be away from home but still feel a little bit like homely and um, meet a lot of people from different places yeah and yeah it's a nice place to to spend time